Hi, it's Russ from Production Expert, and the door challenge we've been given this time is to clean up a couple of tom tracks. This is quite common in modern mixing, where if there's gaps between certain stuff, like on drum tracks, or particularly on tom tracks, they'll clean all the stuff out. What we mean by this is if I quickly play you this drum track, and then I'll just zoom in first on one of these tom tracks, and then I'll solo it. There's all that stuff going on. And we're just, as you see, there's only, there's not that many toms on the track, so it's, it's, it's good if we can make that a much cleaner track. It just helps with mixing to get all that stuff out. So it's pretty straightforward, and we're going to use Strip Silence. Now, Strip Silence has a number of features. You can either work with it with several presets, or you can use manual. I'm going to go manual because I know I'm going to get a much tighter result. So what I'm going to do first is double click on this and go into the audio editor. The reason I do that is because I'm in manual as well, if you see, we've got an open and close threshold. And when you open it in the audio editor, you can see the DB markings there for the threshold. So we know kind of where we need to be. Now I've already been through and set that up and uh, it doesn't take long to do. Then you have the minimum length of then the edit. We could, we could stretch that out a bit if we want. We have pre-roll and post-roll on the edit as well. Then we have fade in and out times. And the great thing about this is it's all non-destructive. So let's just try it first, hit apply. That's done a pretty good job straight away. And the great thing is non-destructive. So if I want to just push the pre-roll out a bit, so don't chop it. That's a bit too much. So I'm going to come back down again to about there. That's about right. And also we can then change the fadings as well. Give that a bit more fading so I don't sort of clip the front end. And there we go. Let's hear that one. That's good. And if we go down the timeline now, we'll see they're all, they're all done. That's about right. That's good. And then what the great thing is then, we just need to go down to the next track. Don't even need to zoom in on this one this time. Hit apply again. And we're done. Job done. And uh, then if we hear that in the track with everything else, let's hear that. That's much cleaner. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.